so I just want to show you a cool little trick I learned. This is a really easy way to make some lip gloss yourself, and it has no anything bad in it. Um, all you're going to need is some coconut oil, about one to two teaspoons, a small pot, a crayon of your color of choice. I'm doing this color and then a container to put your lip gloss in. This is from an Ummy Nummies kit my kids got a while back and I thought it'd be perfect. So set your stove to medium. I already have that done. Then you're just gonna add in your coconut oil. This will melt fairly quick. So I'm not using a spoon on my non-stick, I have a popsicle stick I'm going to stir with. So you just want to get this melted. My stove works fairly nicely. I just got it. So okay, now we're going to add our crayon. I add it in pieces. It makes it easier and faster to melt. that piece isn't breaking. Anyway, this melts fairly fast as well. And it comes out of your pan really easy. So you're just going to stir this continuously until it's melted. It's such a beautiful color with the pan. You're going to have some extra red right in this. It's like a really big container. So just stir it until it's completely melted. Don't stop stirring it at all. Don't stain your pot. It will give your lips a nice little stain though. So this is about the color. Now we're going to turn our stove off. And we're going to remove it from the heat. Okay, now we have our container. And I'm going to put it, I put it on top of another pan so that I don't spill it anywhere and just fill. There we go. Now all you have to do is wait about an hour for it to set. You can put it in the fridge if you would like. It works a lot better that way and then come back. So this is what it's going to look like when it's finally firm. I got it all over me but it's beautiful and it works great. To like put it on, you can use a Q tip too. Ah. So, ooh, close up. And the more you add, the more color you get too. You can also add scents to it or flavors. I put in the last one um, a teeny sprinkle of Kool-Aid and it flavored it nicely. Or I have used before cherry scent too. I like it though. And it's really easy really cheap and it's good for your skin actually coconut oil is like what I use in my hair and it keeps it I have really bad psoriasis so it helps a lot especially since I have dark hair makes my hair really soft anyway thanks for watching this was really fun I love it